Waba <laughs> A horrific tornado struck between Pietermaritzburg and New Hanover in KwaZulu-Natal on November 12, 2019, leaving destruction and devastation of many homes. A year later, families are still picking up the pieces. Stembile Msuomi, an Impulweni resident who was pregnant at the time, narrowly escaped death when her home collapsed. Cabanga Ugutting your Kipu Kokonga Lens in Gubasha, I stroke a gaguas of ham, and Sakaban Gutting some tatam message and Gaubon Moyo Susetos Gasse, Gingena Wardrop, Pagat, Escassin Gingena Wardrop, Ganga, Quasungen and Gomsim and Cosgan Kulel, a thing a shag and getting the seesu, Wapin the Natinga Vog and a shag and Gomsane. Village was the bigger and I went to Conke. Twenty people were injured during the tornado and two people were killed. Tunyeliwe and Lovu's son was one of the casualties. He was trapped inside a room in their home when it collapsed. And Lovu says she lives in constant fear, hoping it won't happen again. <laughs> The tornado struck just two weeks after Joyce Mwelase finished building her new home. She says she had invested about 250,000 Rand. I had just finished uh, building it uh, and then in two weeks time the tornado came. It was finished with the roof and everything was finished. Uh, it was plus minus 250. Mm. Plus I'm unemployed. Mm. So it's my savings from years. So I hadn't moved in that time. I just came to put the windows and the curtains, so I was planning to move anytime. It's been very difficult for almost everyone, but slowly everybody's getting their feet back up. Maganje gwa shinji spaga paga ngiba na lo kuku sinjengi asa ba gwa siskati ngi mfise ngi shukba lega gwa siskati epsu gutolu kutu mai gwa no mo ya ngi bo ninge gwa singeke unkondwamu Ingatinjis, think a banking day, get who's who to a bad day, get the 